Hello and welcome back to Children's Reading Cove. Are you ready to dive into another chapter book? This one is called Henry Hecklebeck Gets a Dragon. Let's read together. Henry Hecklebeck Gets a Dragon by Wanda Coven and illustrated by Priscilla Burris. All right, contents, chapter one, back to school. Henry's eyes popped open. First day of school, he cried. He hopped out of bed, fully dressed. Henry always slept in his clothes. It saved time. He brushed his teeth with his special two-sided toothbrush. It could reach every tooth. Then he zipped into the hallway. Blammo! Henry crashed right into his older sister, Heidi. Hey, bub, watch out next time, she said. Henry apologized. Uh, sorry, sis. Then he took off down the stairs. Henry loved his sister, but sometimes she could be a total grump asaurus. Henry slipped into his seat at the table. Mom gave Henry a strawberry banana smoothie in a to-go cup. He liked to finish his smoothie on the way to the bus stop. It saved time. Heidi plunked down at the kitchen table. Smoothies, she complained. I wanted pancakes. Then why don't you turn your smoothie into what you want, Henry suggested. Heidi looked at Mom. No magic at the table, Mom said firmly. Heidi rolled her eyes. Magic was normal at the Heckelbeck house. Heidi was a witch. So were Henry's mom and Aunt Trudy. Henry and Dad were regular, everyday people. And Henry was fine with that. Henry checked the clock and yelled, Gotta go! Not so fast, said Dad. We need a first day of school picture. It took a few tries before they got the best one. Henry's first day of school was off to a very normal start. But today was going to be anything but normal. That was because Henry Hecklebeck had a secret. He just didn't know it yet. End of chapter one. Come back soon for chapter two. Bye-bye.